We've captured data, we've stored it. Um, you might have some more to tell us about storing, but I don't, I'm, I'm already afraid enough. Um, who owns it in most cases? So when you when you initially sign that end user license agreement or EULA or terms of services or whatever you want to say or call it, that's you giving the company the right to your data. Uh, and so I use the term your data because I believe myself that we as individuals should have not only control over our data, but we should be able to receive our data. Okay. Now, we're not there yet as a culture because there's no piece of software or no way I can ingest the data that I create in yeah. the same way that a company could with their, you know, because it takes a lot of money to get all this stuff going. Mm -hmm. uh, and AI has been a big help in getting all of this stuff to where it is. But I, I firmly believe that we will get to a point to where the conversation is about how I receive my own personal data for using it in the ways that I see fit, not, not the ways a company sees fit. Now, I don't know if that looks like, uh, you know, they keep a copy and I've got a copy and then mm -hmm. I can request they delete their copy or, or what, but we're, we're not there at, because right now I don't get a choice at all. I can say, uh, Facebook delete my stuff. And they're like, you, you live in Tennessee? No. Yeah. If you live in Europe, yes, because GDPR requires that a company follow a specific process to delete that information. Gotcha. I personally don't like the idea of deleting years worth of information about myself uh, for any reason whatsoever. But I, again, I want to, I want to have it I, yeah. because it's mine. It's not like there's this personal data repository somewhere in the cloud that all these companies are being gracious enough to put my information in just in case I ever wanted it at some point. Yet. <laughs> Yet, but wouldn't that be great? And mm -hmm. that does make a lot of sense so that you would actually have control of your data. 